Well, good morning. We are tracking some changes on the way here as we go through your Tuesday. We'll be warm. We'll be muggy ahead of things uh, as we go through the first part of the day. But then by the second part of the day, that cold front rolls through and behind the cold front temperatures fall 65 at 4 o'clock down to 52 by 10 and in the 40s by 10 o'clock. That's where we'll start off officially for a high tomorrow. It's near around 40 degrees at midnight. Then temperatures continue to fall and as we head into tomorrow afternoon, going to have to watch for the potential for them to go down below freezing. Not the case this morning, though you will have a few showers as we start off your morning. Now watch what happens as we get into the middle of the day. Temperatures near 80 south of the front, then that front continues to work on through here by the time we get into the middle of the day. Look at those temperatures falling. By 10 o'clock, we're into the upper 40s, lower 50s with a biting north wind making things feel like they're in the 30s. And look at tomorrow morning. Temperatures flirting with the freezing mark. We'll have to watch for the potential for some freezing drizzle northwest of Waco Temple Clean. And as those temperatures fall, could see that start to work towards the Waco Temple Clean area by the middle of the afternoon. Now, I don't think this is going to cause any sort of power outages, but this freezing drizzle will be enough to cause a few issues on area roadways, particularly those bridges and those overpasses. I think the biggest time frame we're going to need to watch is Wednesday night into Thursday as we get another surge of moisture. That's when we'll see more widespread freezing drizzle set up. The temperature should be below freezing across a large part of central Texas. Notice doesn't make it all the way to Bryan College Station. That freeze line could wiggle a little further south, but I do think we'll have to watch that morning commute coming up on Thursday and during the day on Thursday as well as temperatures hang around in the 30s. The other thing is those north winds will be around, so it's going to be feeling much colder, feeling like the 20s for much of the day, both Wednesday and for Thursday. 78 your high for today. Enjoy it while you can. We're 40 degrees cooler tomorrow. 40 is when we'll start at uh, midnight and temperatures will fall. We'll be in the 30s much of the day tomorrow. A little bit warmer in the Brazos Valley, only getting into the mid 30s optimistically on Thursday. And then look at those temperatures slowly climbing once we get past the weekend. Could be getting close to 70 as we head on into next week. That's a look at your updated 10 day forecast. Thanks for staying tuned to 25 weather. I'm meteorologist Josh John.